So let me do it for you. There's the Goddard Institute for Space Studies temperatures. And is it getting warmer? Yes, the confidence of this, high. If you take a long enough interval that is a statistically significant regression line, it's up. But notice how you can do this. So I, John said I'd be doing this, so I have to do this, right? I am born in 1957. There's the data from 1957 up to a little later, the regression line through the data, and you can see I was born at the start of a cooling trend. I married my dear wife Cindy who's sitting back here in 1980 we had to stay warm somehow because we got married at the start of a cooling trend which you can see very clearly okay we moved to Penn State in 1988 at the start of a cooling trend we did have fun we, we had a couple daughters we came out here to show them the big mountains in 1997 the start of a cooling trend we, um, they named a glacier after me in 2002, a very short, very steep cooling trend you can see there. And, and our daughter became a Penn Stater. She's now a science teacher, but she became a Penn Stater in 2005 at the start of a cooling trend. So my whole life... <sighs> okay, now recognize this is, this is, right, as long as the world is variable, you can do this forever. It's really amazing. All you do is, if there's a year of rapid warming, shut up. And then you can go right back to claiming the global warming stopped uh, until the next rapid warming, and then shut up, and then go right back to claiming the global warming shot ad infinitum. 